Hey everyone, this is my next installment of GTA 4. This is not another Volunteer Nico episode. Instead, I want to shed a little light on something that I have been thinking about for a very long time. Have you ever noticed if, uh, that is, if you're a, a big buff like I am, and you love getting the responses, have you ever notice how uh, if they, if they, they, they get a fire call, it's like they can't get out the door fast enough. But to get an EMS call, it's like... Are they ever going to leave the station? And now, I just... I, I'm not going to... Uh, I'm not trying to... Get on anyone's nerves. I don't want to make anyone feel bad. Over what I said. Certainly don't want to cause any trouble. But... You ever notice that? And I was just thinking that, I mean, you're generally not going to know ahead of time what the scene looks like until you get there. So, shouldn't they all just treat each call with the same level of urgency? Right? You get your gear, you go to the trucks, you get in, and you leave. You don't waste any time. Right? And and by the way, what's more important? Someone's life or a building? Because you can rebuild a building, but you cannot replace a person. So anyways, in this video, there's going to be two different calls. There's going to be a structure fire in a single family home with no occupants. Right? No occupants. Further uh, further confirming that a building is definitely not as important as someone's life. The second, the other call is going to be for uh, difficulty breathing, something I hear a lot when I'm scanning in Hartford. I'm not going to tell you which call is which until, af until the end of the episode. And here we go. Without any further ado, I give you the first call. You try and figure out which is which.
Sorry about that uh, right there. The taxi came out of nowhere. <laughs> hate when they do that. The vehicle just spawns out of thin air. All right, now for the second call. And here is the second call. It should have been rather easy to figure out. The first call was the difficulty for eating. The second call was the fire. So you, you obviously noticed the, the extreme difference in, in urgency, right? It's just something that bothers me, right? You don't know what it's going to be... The, you don't know what the scene is going to be like until you get there, so... They should just all treat, they should just treat the calls uh, the same. Fire, EMS, elevator, odor of gas, whatever. Just treat them all the same. I just think it's better that way. If uh, you have any questions, comments, anything you want to say, please let me know what's on your mind. Until next time. See you later, boys.